What is it like living in Puerto Rico right now? Now, okay, now. I'll, I'll talk about the past in a second, but now mm-hmm. it's how? Okay, uh, well, okay. Now, how is it living in Puerto Rico financially, like metaphorically, or like just life in general? The mood. The life mood. Life in okay, general. Mood, the, what the is mood. the mood in people? How would you oh, say? Okay. It? okay. The mood right now is 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 is. Because so in America, the mood is very confused. People are not sure it, whether they go out or stay at home. Over here. Oh, okay. Okay. Talk, okay talking about COVID. Oh, yeah. Okay. Um. No, not necessarily COVID. In general, because uh, over here, if we're affected this way, take an example on my uh, mother, uh, my 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 native country, I'm Armenian. Yeah. In, uh, in, it, it wouldn't even be considered a third world world country. I would say even fourth world country. Wow. But, yeah, yeah, it's it's really it, it is not good. Um, so not much going on with the circulation of uh, finances with government related so the people don't really have work if the government doesn't even have work going on best believe small businesses won't have it either so a lot of corruption going on over there as well and I know and the COVID on top of all that it just made everything a lot worse and people before COVID honestly had a little tiny bit of hope but now when I speak to my relatives living in Armenia that hope is gone too and me personally i know opening your eyes in the morning waking up every morning and not having at least not a single grain of hope is devastating that's mental uh, you know what i mean that that that's that's actually a lot of people would argue even more dangerous than physical the, the, the discomfort because mental just uh, you would understand this more than i could ever like, explain mental states which you just like the ptsd that now like almost 10 years after finally you're speaking to me for an example about it and i hope uh, that some way made made it a bit less pressure for you so it took you 10 years to do this as you get what i mean so i can imagine living without hope is just devastating mentally and that's going to cause a lot more 10 years from now too so what is it like uh, the country of there they, did they affect as much too or is it the same as the u.s it's we're not struggling as much as everyone thinks that we are at the moment right now mm-hmm. after maria it took a year to get restructured and everything's just back to normal again cars are still getting crashed people are still dying politics are still corrupted people are still going out not wearing their mask mm. but now in the beginning of the year, it was it was the it was the tone of the tourist. Everyone was affected by tourism. Everyone was affected by how the tourists are destroying places and doing just acting a fool. Now, okay, fine, whatever that happens. Then now, it's more focused on random stuff every single day because over here in the islands, we get mad over something for a week. Something mm-hmm. happens, we get mad for it. We go on to the next thing. Let's just like America. It's just right. we have a really short attention span. It's really bad. Right. Last week, like two weeks ago, I talked about the boxer who supposedly killed his um his side chick and the baby that was inside her. Boxer. And she was pregnant. She was pregnant. Mind you. Mm. That was oh. the news for a whole week. For the whole week. Come Monday, last Monday, switched it. No, now we're gonna talk about the girl that went to court. To file for a uh, domestic abuse, and that that story that story is so sad. I talked about it on my channel, but mm-hmm. in short, she went. She she knew her. She knew her boyfriend was abusive. She stayed away from him. He kept trying to attack her. She went to the courts. Went to the police station. This guy's doing this. Here's the evidence. The police saw justification to arrest them. They go to court. The guys with his lawyer, the judge is there. The cop that arrested him. She's there. No prosecutor. Really? No prosecutor. And because of that, the case gets dropped. Three days later. Never heard that before. Usually it's a. They they found her body burnt. Three days later. Yeah, that's the same face I did. Yep. Wow. It escalated quickly. It is messed up. And it's a failure of the court system here. The court system here. The court system here. Compared to America, is so bad because, for example, like I said in my video, mm-hmm. you can literally, I can go right now, grab a gun, go to a mall, shoot somebody, 
in front of a camera, say hate speech and all that stuff. But if I got a good lawyer, fifty thousand dollar bond, easy, easy, wow. and walk away. This, Why is it like that in your opinion? Because here we make money. We make money off bonds. We only have two. We only have two two um, prisons here: a prison for men and a prison for women. Okay. That's it. So when it's full up, they're full up. And there's people there, there are people here that literally got arrested for killing someone, went to jail for two days, paid for the bond, got out, killed another person, got arrested again, had enough money to get up get bond out of that one, and because he's involved in something dirty, they found his body the next day burnt. Like over here, uh, the system, yeah, the system here is it, the system here is. Is and do you hear stories like that on the news? Does the news not major, here? Not doesn't here. cover it, right? No, you have, you have to go. You have to go online to people that are actually like going to police reports and printing them out and say, "Look, this is happening. This is happening." People mm. on camera saying, "Look, I'm over here. This is happening," because they only talked about the girl that it got doesn't get picked up by the main media. No, it doesn't. The boxer mm. got picked up by the main media because he's a boxer that 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 is is in a um. His name is this. His name is Felix. He's a high profile figure. Yeah, his name is this. His name is Felix Veldejo. There it is. 